And let's begin with the news that's just come in from Mumbai. Legendary singer Bappi Lehri has passed away in a Mumbai hospital at the age of 69. We're awaiting details of exactly what happened. But the singer-composer, known for so many peppy tracks and for giving us so many foot-tapping numbers over the last many, many years, has unfortunately passed away. A Mumbai doctor has confirmed this tragic news. Reactions also coming in right now on social media for the singer who in fact inspired so many, cut across generations, not just because of his compositions and his songs, but also because of uh, his mannerisms and also his style quotient, something that resonated with so many people and so many generations. This is truly a huge, huge loss for India and the world. Amit Yagi is joining us live from Mumbai with more details on this. Amit, tragic news that's come in. Any information that we've been able to pick up, any statement that's been put out so far from Bappi Lehri's family or from the hospital where he was being treated? Amit, can you hear me? Yeah, hello. Amit, can you give us details if there's been any statement that's come in from uh, Bappi Lehri's family or from the hospital where he was being treated? We've been trying to reach the family, but uh, I, I think uh, they're all in the morning shock, but it's been confirmed that Bappi Lehri is no more. Another loss for the industry after Lata Mangeshkar. In fact, the day when Lata Mangeshkar passed away, Bappi Lehri's daughter and his wife and all, they were there at the funeral, but Bappi Lehri was not seen. So he has not been keeping well for a long time. And uh, the day, uh, uh, it's been long uh, that he's been ailing. So uh, it seems that that took uh, uh, the, the reason he could attend Datta's funeral. Had he's been really uh, lately had stopped making public appearances. Otherwise, he was a very public person. And lately, because of his health, he couldn't uh, uh, be seen more. And I think uh, it's a big loss for the industry because uh, Bappi Lahari has a significant contribution to the Indian music industry, especially in the 80s and the 90s. The kind of music he brought to the Indian cinema was very different. And he was the few uh, music directors who actually collaborated at that time in the 90s with Samantha Fox and all. So his uh, music has a different soul and different feel to it which is very important and uh, uh, for that because it's kind of revolutionized a new sound in in the industry and uh, many of his films they will be the landmark when we talk of music and it's really really a big loss i must say truly a huge loss and this is you know even as we're all still uh, coming to terms with the fact that we lost legendary singer Lata Mangeshkar. As Amit pointed out, uh, Bappi Lehri has been ailing for some time now. He's been treated for multiple illnesses. Uh, his family members were also present paying their tributes to Lata Mangeshkar recently. He wasn't there owing to his ill health. But the tragic news that's just come in as uh, the hospital in which he was being treated in Mumbai has confirmed his passing away. But let's also focus on um, uh, all of the memories, all of the amazing compositions and songs that he's left us with, uh, Amit. Uh, a huge, huge legacy that we're not going to be forgetting, that we're so very grateful for. Amit, uh, you know, you're someone who's tracked the industry so closely. So tell us really and uh, take us through Bappi Lehri's legacy, why he was so often called the disco king. Well, uh, Bappi Lehri, uh... The, has some really uh, uh, chartbusters he has given his last uh, few hit was uh, uh, Dirty Picture where uh, Ula La has became uh, the green generation sound and his uh, one of his favorite uh, compositions whenever we I used to interview him he used to always sing the song the song was Chirodini uh, in Bangla and Hindi mein, uh, the song was uh, Dil Mein Hoon To Jaa Hoon Tum uh, was uh, his favorite song his best composition he always used to say that song became like a trademark for Bappi Lahiri. You know, this song was uh, one of the Vinod Khanna's, one from Vinod Khanna's film, which was later made in Bangla as well. So we kind of brought that sound and the, uh, the the Bangla music and the Hindi music. He kind of, you know, 
he 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 kind of mixed uh, those uh, sounds and he had worked with lata mangeshkar asha bhosle all those singers and and in as i said 80s and 90s were papil harris time especially those uh, times when indian music was not exposed to so much of foreign influence he was the one who collaborated with samantha fox at that time and uh, his one of his uh, biggest hit was disco dancer which uh, revolutionized his career in hindi film industry so disco dancer was one uh, very big film of uh, bappi lahiri in fact it's the biggest it was the biggest it still is considered one of the biggest uh, hit even in russia you know he mm-hmm. the disco dancer was and his song jimmy jimmy was was a cult in russia you know imagine if a song made in india was a cult in a country uh, so jimmy jimmy was is one of his best composition you know it's it's regarded as one of the best even in russia it's the it's, it's the it's like the anthem you know i had myself experienced it uh, when i had gone to armenia a country in eurasia that the cult of jimmy for them india means J- jimmy jimmy uh, so that was the craze of uh, uh, bappi lahiri's music uh, worldwide so that i had seen myself so, Besides that, there are many others. Sharabi uh, is one of his best composition. If we look at his musical journey, right. and he was a good singer as well. You know his his uh, his his uh, sound, his way of singing was very different. You know, but, uh, but always you know so many songs of Bappi Lahiri. If we look as uh, one of his Lata Mangeshkar and Bappi Lahiri's uh, songs right. come to my mind is Ulo Ka Chaman. which was a very uh, good and composition and i'm sure everyone and... i'm sure everyone remembers that song uh, with so much fondness we've lost unfortunately both of those legends uh, in a span of one week truly tragic news coming in we're going to be tracking all the tributes that come in as well this morning for singer composer papilleri thanks amit for joining us